Hello everyone and welcome back to Geek News. I am your host, I am Adam, and today we've got another video coming at you, unexpected video, Mattel Creations, Virgil Abloh times Masters of the Universe Collector Figures. So let's go ahead and let's see what these are all about, shall we? And we got some photos to accommodate them. So it says Virgil Abloh's newest canvas in the Masters of the Universe Revelations universe and we couldn't be more excited. The new Masters of the Universe CO Virgil Abloh toy figures feature monochromatic hues and text-based intervention that re recontextualize the figures and allows people to look at these iconic toys in a new light. Virgil Abloh leaves his mark on Eternia, its shades of monochromatic nude or iconic characters from Masters of the Universe reimagined by the legendary artist and longtime Masters of the Universe fan. Choose from He-Man, Skeletor, Battle Cat, and Skelly God. Each figure comes with its accessories like swappable hands and battle weapons for epic displays. Also includes a comic book art print illustrated by Reggie No. Okay, let's go ahead. Let's check out these photos, shall we? So here is our group photo. We've got He-Man going on here. We've got Battle Cat, Skeletor, and of course Skelly God. And yes, they are Revelation based. So these are basically remolded masters of the universe in basically what looks to be a chrome color plastic. That's pretty much what this is to me. But looks pretty cool. I can't deny that Battle Cat looks pretty awesome nonetheless. We've got He-Man going on here. So here he is. Pretty cool stuff going on there. So they are fully articulated as you can plainly see. Pretty neat going on there. Uh, let's move on. So there's another He-Man one we got going on here too. You can see all the way down. I'm really liking the color of the plastic though. It looks pretty neat. So let's see. Here is the packaging going on here. So it looks like they have some unique packaging going on in the inside. So we got the two extra hands. We got the shield, the sword for He-Man. Uh, there's our Skeleton God, so two extra hands, the sword, and the blast effect. So basically the exact same accessories that you would have gotten. So there's Skeleton God. Actually, that doesn't look too, too bad. It actually looks kind of neat. And there is a print of our comic book going on there. And I'm not sure what that says. It just says Masters of the Universe. I don't know what this says. Certified text. So basically a certified card. We got the Havoc staff looking there. And there is our Skeletor. So we got the Havoc Staff, Shaping Staff, and of course the two open hands. And he will have the fist and an open hand for the Havoc Staff. And there is our another Skeletor. So he looks like he's a little bit more of a cream color plastic going on there is what he looks like. I think it's cool on the cape. I think the cape looks neat out of all of it. I don't know, something about the brown cape just looks kind of neat. And there's our Battle Cat. So Battle Cat looks pretty freaking cool. I can't deny. I kind of like the looks of it. I like to see what Cringer looks like underneath. And yeah, so there's Skeletor once again with the shaping stuff. So we got a bunch of photos. Uh, I don't think there's a need to go through every single one of them, but there's another Battle Cat shot. I will just kind of flick through them quickly. Oh, there we go. There's our Cringer. So here's our Cringer look without the armor on. So cool stuff going on there. Fully articulated. A nice another Skelly God. So it looks like the Battle Cat one has more of a darker brown color tone to it. And there's our He-Man as well as He-Man. He-Man's definitely got a darker tone going on down there compared to what Skelly God has and there's our another image of the comic so there's the shield and sword i think the shield looks really cool i think it looks neat and yeah i'm surprised they didn't do evil in because it looks like they're basically doing uh what appears to be just wave one right so i'm surprised they didn't do evil in i think evil in would have been really cool uh in this set but there you have it there's the photos. So let's pop over to Mattel Creations just for a moment so we can get some more information on what's going on here so we're not quite done. So as we look down here, we've got one day, 19, uh, 19 hours, so just under two days, uh, 51 minutes and 17 seconds of the turn time of this recording. Uh, so stay tuned for it. It's Mattel Creations. I cover Mattel Creations live, so I will more than likely be covering this live. So stay tuned for it. 
uh, we'll cover this live and have some fun. So it'll be kind of cool there. And yeah, so let me see what the details are, if there's any limits for the characters or anything like that. So it's going to say listed sold out right now, but that doesn't mean they're actually sold out. It just means that they're not ready yet. So it says here, uh, launches October 21st, 9 a.m. Pacific time. So I think that's uh, 11, I think that's, I think that's 11 or 12. I think it's probably around lunchtime, my time. So I'll have to mark that on my calendar. So October 21st and limit two per customer. So you're only going to be able to order them two per customer. And we've got $74 on He-Man. I wonder if they're all the same price here. Let's find out. Now, I might have went a little bit far too back. I guess that's okay. Let's go back up to the top here. Okay, uh, no, so we got Battle Cat is 120. Uh, and Skelly God is 89 and Skeletor and He-Man is 74.99. Just so that you guys know the pricing. I assume they're all going to be limit two per customer, but I'll double check Battle Cat here. Yes, limit two per customer. So they're all going to launch once again, October 21st, 2022 at 9 a.m. specific time. So stay tuned. I'll cover this stuff live and we'll see you guys then. So I'm going to head out and you guys take care and you guys have a good day. And you guys let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, subscribe and hit that notification bell, folks. So you guys have a good day and we'll see you on the next one. Until next time. Take care, guys.